Congratulations on winning the first Sea Lords Award for digital media. It's a crowded marketplace, digital media, and you have to fight to make an impact you clearly have. How much does this mean to you, winning this award? The recognition of the judging panel and the, the public nomination is really important for the 1851 Marine Trust. Our STEM crew platform is really trying to establish itself at the moment with teachers and schools across the UK. So recognition helps us raise awareness of, of the maritime context that, that we hope to inspire young people with. Now here's a difficult one. How have you made that difference? What do you think is one of the keys, without giving any secrets away to your competitors, what's the key to cutting through like that? I think we really focus on, on two things. One, we want to be as inspirational as we can be for the young people. So that's really focusing on what's cutting edge and exciting about the sailing context, the America's Cup context that we work alongside. And secondly, for teachers, it's so important to be related to the curriculum. There's a lot of pressure on teachers to fill, um, to teach their time, and we really focus on what they need to do. Now, what's the future hold for you? Any particular plans, without giving too much away, clearly, but any future plans on how you'd like to develop the website? Well, we're always looking at how we can integrate better technology and better functionality to keep up with the use of technology in schools. We're also looking at how we can expand the content that we've got as we run into the America's Cup in 2021. Congratulations again, well done, and I'm looking forward to seeing the first Sea Lord give you the first Sea Lords Award. He does give it away, you know. Superb, yeah, no, and we're looking forward to ringing the bell. Thank you. Thank you very much.